So hi everyone, welcome to our channel. So in the previous class we discussed about uh, PDNF examples without using truth table. So today we are going to discuss about PCNF without using truth table. And what is the given problem for us? Negation P implies R and the Q double implies P. Okay. So first we will divide this. So as we know that P implies Q can be written as negation P or Q. P double implies Q can be written as P implies Q and the Q implies P. So let's apply here. So here P implies Q, uh, P impl negation P implies R can be written as negation of negation P or R and and Q implies P can be written as Q implies P and P implies Q. Okay. So negation or negation, negation, negation cancel P or R and Q implies P can be written as negation Q or P and negation P or Q. So P implies Q can be written as negation P or Q. So if you see here, as of now, it is in the form of product of sums. This is sum 1, sum 2, sum 3 and these are product. But what we need to do here? Here a literal is missing. Here I have P R Q is missing. Here I have P Q R is missing. Here I have P Q R is missing. Right? Now, as we know that A R false equal to A. Okay? So let me write here P or R or false. So in PDNF we wrote true. Here we should write false. And negation Q or P or false. And the negation P or Q or false. Right? So what is missing here? Q is missing, right? So P or R or in the place of false we should write Q and a negation Q. So previously we wrote Q or negation Q. In PCNF we should write Q or uh, Q and negation Q like that. Negation Q or P or R and a negation R. Likewise, negation P or Q or R and a negation R. Clear? Now, if you see here, this is also a distributive law. So, distributive law. So what do we get? P or R or Q and P or R or negation, uh, sorry, negation Q. And second so distributive law, negation Q or P or R and negation Q or P or negation R and negation P or Q or R and negation P or Q or negation R. Okay. So I am writing at the uh, top. So what do you get? P or Q, P or R or Q can be written as P or Q or R and P or negation Q or R and P or negation Q or R and P or negation Q or negation R and negation P or Q or R and negation P or Q or negation R. So let's see. Uh, any repetitions here? So if you see here, I have PQR. Okay, so PQR is not repeating. P negation QR. Here I have P negation QR again. Okay, here this is P negation Q negation R. That's it. Only one, uh, two repetitions are there. We will write once. So final, final one is 
P or Q or R and P or negation Q or R and P or negation Q or negation R and negation P or Q or R and negation P or Q or negation R. This is our final PCNF. So I hope you understood uh, clearly uh, how we obtain a principal conjunctive normal form with using truth table without using truth table. In the same manner, principal disjunctive normal form with using truth table and without using truth table. So I hope you understood the concept clearly. So those who are watching my channel for the first time, I request you to please subscribe our channel. Please share our videos to your friends and well-wishers. Please support our channel in all possible ways. Thank you. Thank you very much and have a wonderful day.